Hi guys, I'm Jasmine. So this is a story about the pretty much most interesting birthday I've had. So we'd been planning this trip for months. It was like the day we were finally going to go to Big Bear and I was like, oh my gosh, I was so excited. We're going to spend the weekend up at the cabin. It's my birthday. I was like, dude, this is like best birthday, right? Going to go turn up in a cabin. Just kidding. It's your family. <laughs> So we get in the car, my, my whole family comes over, we're like, okay, we're ready to start driving to Big Bear. So we drive up to Big Bear, finally get there, we stop in this like cute little town and go shopping, and I'm like jumping out of the car, I'm like, oh, I'm going to see snow for the first time. I was so excited to see snow. Get out of the car, start walking around, and everything's like all sunny, it's a little chilly, so I have my jacket on, and then I'm looking around, and there's like, there's no snow. There's so just like a little patch, and I'm like, mom, look, there's snow here. <laughs> and so my dad was like, okay, guys, you know, let's go and find a place for snow. So we're like, okay. So we drive up, and we go see, um, like, this beautiful, like, trees everywhere, snow everywhere. It looks like a little cute little picture that you frame in your wall. So I go out, and I'm like, oh, my gosh, there's actual real snow. So I go, and I put my jacket on, and I'm, like, walking out like a big old marshmallow. I have my little cousins with me, and they're like, it's their first time seeing snow, too. So we're all super excited. So you know, we go, we get our sleds, we start sliding down, we're throwing snowballs at each other, and then it starts snowing. And I'm like, oh my gosh, this is like a winter wonderland. <laughs> so I'm just there hanging around, we're all having a good time, there's people all around us, and we're there for quite some time. And then you know, people start leaving, and we're just like the only ones there. And we're just like, you know what? Let's go get some pizza, because that sounds like a good idea when it's snowing. So we go to this little town, there's like pizza shop there, we go get pizza, it's super cozy in there, looking out the window, snow's still falling slowly start to you know, pile up on the cars and we're like, oh my gosh, the snow's piling up on cars, guys. Isn't that cool? <laughs> so we go out and we're like, you know what, let's go. Okay, we're going to go up to the cabin, unload, and we're just going to you know, relax for the rest of the day. So we go into the car, you know, starting to drive out, and then there's like this little hill at the exit of like the parking lot. So we're driving up the hill and then all of a sudden like my car starts sliding back, right? Mm -hmm. So I'm like freaking out. There's cars behind us, cars in front of us. Everyone's just like honking at us and we're just like sliding down and I'm like, oh my gosh, we're gonna like die here. My sister's like, what the heck? We're gonna flip over. My dad's like, y'all need to stop talking so I can drive. <laughs> so he's like, he hits the gas and <laughs> he's just like going at it. And we finally make it up to the top of the hill. We pull off to the side and we're just stuck there, right? And my uncle's stuck at the bottom of the hill. And it was just a mess. I was like, oh, this is so great. You know, it's here in the snow, stuck here. It was fantastic. So we were there, probably there for about six hours, stuck in the snow. Just freaking, we're like, I don't even know what to do. There's cars laid out everywhere in front of us. Everyone's just like pulled off to the side and we're like, look it, we're all tourists here. We all don't know how to drive in the snow. So my daddy's like, you know what, let's go down. We're going to go find some chains, put on the chains, and we'll, you know, we'll get out of here. So he goes, gets the chains, we're like trying to put it on the tires, and it takes us like three times, three tries to realize that the chains are too small for the tire. Oh. So we <laughs> have to go back down, go and find the right measure of chains. And so we're just sitting there in the car with my mom and my sister, and we're just there, and we're just like, oh my gosh, we're going to have to stay here in the night. And my sister's freaking out, she's like, we're going to get eat by wolves, and I'm like, dude, we're not going to get eaten by wolves, we're in a car. <laughs> and so we're just sitting there, and then all of a sudden there's this car that's like coming down the side of the road, and I'm like, what the heck, look at this guy driving up. And he's just there. You see him like coming up into my view. He has a cigarette in one hand, right? He's like this. One hand on the wheel, just driving it, turning it. It's like 2,000 degree Cadillac. His like tires aren't even spinning. He is just sliding down that hill. He's like sliding right towards us. And I'm just like, oh my gosh, this guy does not know how to drive and he is going to hit us. So he's there, barely misses our car, and then he goes down to the hill and crashes at the bottom of the hill. And I'm like, oh, good thing it wasn't us. So, <laughs> but he was okay. He was okay. <laughs> So then, you know, we're just there, my dad comes back, finally get the tires on, the chains on the tire, and we're just like, you know what, it's already late, it's probably like 11 o'clock, we're just gonna, might as well just sleep here. So we all get our blankets, luckily we had everything still packed in the car. So we have our blankets, we're all just sitting there, and it's still, it was pretty cold, it's like in the snow, our car starts getting piled up the snow, and I was just sitting there with my blanket, and I'm like, oh gosh, this is just, you know, fantastic birthday. Ended it, sleeping in a car, it was just crazy. So yeah, that's how I spent my 15th birthday. <laughs>